What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Lil Matt JTV. Here bringing you another review. I'm trying to get some of these videos out, but man, having a young one, you get so busy and you don't realize how much time those little ones take of yours, but it's worth it. You know, she's my little girl and she's been nothing but a pleasure. She's such a little, you know, just a little sweetheart. So, but, but I'm here to bring you another review. I was introduced to a soap called Valhalla. Valhalla is a soap that a lot of people have been talking about. I know the scent inventor, actually, this is one of his favorite soaps right now. This is a small business, specializes in all kinds of beer products, and they make soaps. <clears throat> they make all kinds of different, like beard washes, beard butters, beard oils, so if you're interested in that kind of stuff, then this is the company you need to be looking at. I did get a few bars. He actually sent this one to me for free, no charge, which is awesome. Thank you so much. I'm actually in the Valhalla Facebook group, so um, I'm always here for supporting smaller companies. I feel like, you know, I feel like they take better pride in their products and their customer service because, you know, they, they got to prove themselves, and I feel like the smaller companies do a great job at that. So, I'm gonna go ahead and hop on this Bahala soap review right after this. <laughs> started I want to give a shout out to the Grizzly the Grizzly Naturals they sent me all kinds of stuff I mean they, they sent me all the stuff to try and I mean look at all that goodness it smells pretty fresh I like it so I'm gonna be doing that on another video I just want to kind of show you that Grizzly Naturals you're about to be up to bat pretty soon Let's go ahead and start in Bahala Soap Review. Before I get started, I'm going to let you know, you might hear my neighbor's dog. He tends to bark here and there, so don't pay him no attention. You can hear him in the background. So, first off, I got a few soaps. I got this one, which was the Fray. I like this one because it comes with a special rope around the soap. It helps keep you from dropping it. And I also got one that I have used. I think this is Valkyrie. This one's going to be Pineapple, Coconut, and Plumera. I have used this soap, and I here here to tell you this soap right here on another level. And I also have a what is this? Freja, Freja. This is a lavender bar, also with the rope on it. I like that. I like the rope on it. It, it gives it a cool effect, and I think it's pretty cool. So first off, I'm gonna start with the soap that I've used, which is Valkyrie. Valkyrie has a very it has a very fresh, like, tropical scent to it. It has like that coconut, pineapple, kind of like a pina colada with a slight freshness to it. It almost has like a flowery, like a floral pineapple, like a floral pina colada. It smells really good. And I like the print that they, he puts on his bars. I think that's a really cool touch. You know, it's like a Viking effect. Um, I know Valhalla has to do with Vikings and I think it's really cool you know he puts his own signature stamp on it which is is really cool and I like the colors I like how it has like that shine to it which I think is the Mika or Mika however you pronounce it it has some glow in there if you really look I don't know if you can see it but it has like this glitter that kind of it just kind of glimmers in the in the light but this one, one positive thing I can say about the soap is the lather on it is insane. The lather is fantastic. It lathers up very well. And there's just something about it that doesn't smell like other soaps. It, it's, it's not, it has a signature smell. You know how there's these other soap companies that you smell the soap and it kind of smells similar to another soap you smell? This does not. This definitely has its own touch on it. 
So I would definitely, definitely say that this bar right here is good stuff. All right, next up is going to be Frey. I have not opened this one up yet, but it's going to be Birch EO and Bourbon Tobacco, FO. I don't know what that stands for, but I like this rope. This rope effect is really cool. This one's going to have a nice, fresh, has like a nice, fresh bourbon scent to it. I like that. Ah, very fresh. Almost has like a like a, almost like a spring scent to it. it. Smells like something that you would use in the spring, you know, when the flowers are blossoming and everything is starting to come in. You know, it's. I like this one. This one's really good. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and read the ingredients. It's going to be palm oil, coconut oil, olive, shea butter, grapeseed oil. Safflower, safflower oil, which is interesting. I haven't seen grapeseed oil in soap before, and that's pretty interesting. Safflower oil, cocoa butter, sodium lactate, which is, I'm guessing, lye, raw sugar, distilled water, sodium hydroxide, and colored using mica powder and titanium dioxide. So the mica is in there. I think that I think it's the mica that gives it that shimmer, which I think is cool. But yeah, this one has a nice scent. I really like that scent. I'm almost determined to open it, but I don't want to open it yet because I'm not using it. But let me crack it a little bit more to get a better scent. Yeah, I like this one for sure. This one has a nice, a nice spring effect. I don't know, something about it just reminds me of spring. Great job on this bar. Last but not least is going to be the Freja. This is going to be lavender, chamomile, chamomile, and jasmine. I, sometimes I can't pronounce this stuff. But this one's going to be a whitish, purplish bar. And it's going to have that nice, fresh lavender scent to it. It's going to have like a, it's probably going to act like a, give you that nice calming effect in the shower oh yeah very nice and you can see the print you can see the print on the inside his stamp which is cool I like the color differences how it goes from like white and you see a little purple little purple effects in there and how it tops off with the purple it's a very cool effect these are different these are definitely different and if these bars are anything like Valkyrie these bars are going to be top notch. Use a soap gripper when you have a freaking rope on your soap. Whatever you do, though, don't drop it. I'm telling you from experience. These soaps are fantastic smelling. But this one right here is my favorite. That's why I use this one first. And I tried not to use it in the shower because I waited to do this review. And I tried so hard not to use it as much as I wanted to in the shower because I wanted it to keep its, its print so that I can show you guys what it looks like without having to open these to show you what the actual print looks like. So it's been hard. I've used this bar like two times and you can see it doesn't shrink very much. I seen in the group how this soap seems to last and as you can see I use this bar I think twice and it hasn't shrunk very much you know it has a little bit but it's soap you know but it's it still has a good amount for only two showers so I thought that was pretty pretty interesting as well anyone who has tried Bahala soap please leave your comments down below show the guy some love if you're interested in his products I will leave that link down below so you can go check out the stuff that he has to offer and if you're looking to grow a beard like I wish I could but apparently I can't I'm part of patchy I don't know if there's actually products out there that can help you grow one but as of right now uh, my stuff is a, a mess which I need a trim so anybody who can grow a beard I recommend checking this company out because I think that's what he really specializes in is the beard health because the owner has a beard. So go check out his products and show the guy some love. It's going to do it guys. Thank you for stopping by and checking out this review. I appreciate everybody's support. Let's keep the subscribers going. We're slowly climbing, but I'm going to get these videos out so we can get more, spread the word, 
anybody who's interested in this kind of content, be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more. It's going to do it, guys. Check you guys out on the next one. And as always, until next time, peace out.